here is the terrible experience I had with Jason Bond. Number one, these are marketing people. They run specials and ads anywhere all the time. They've got special deals going. Uh, I did get an email after I signed up. You can get three months of a subscription service for $99 for three months. Uh, but they've got gimmicks upon gimmicks upon gimmicks. They've got webinars nonstop. So, I mean, any, anytime you go to a website, they've got recorded webinar you can watch, which they try and con you into buying their product. Anyway, I had the misfortune of signing up for three months to their advisory service, which I'll tell you more about shortly what a gimmick it is. And then they had a pop-up window where you can get an additional year, an additional nine months. It made it sound like $4.99 would take care of the full nine months, but it didn't. That was $4.99 extra. And of course, I, I clicked the button in error, and when I found out the mistake I had made, I contacted them immediately via email, telling them I want to keep the initial 298 service, but I would like to discontinue the 499 because I hit it in error. Of course, they don't care about that. I mean, this Jason Bond, he brags he makes $50,000 a week sometimes trading stocks, but they can't afford a refund 290 or 499 So anyway, I disputed with my credit card company, and Jason Bond sent like a three- or four-page thing disputing my dispute. So basically, the way it looks, I'll get stuck paying 499 extra for a service I was tricked into. But that's the worst part. I mean, they're very greedy people. They do not offer refunds. So if you sign up, beware. All sales final. Jason Bond, also known as Raging Bull, when you get the bill. And I can see why they're Raging Bull, because when you get the bill, you're raging. There's nothing you can do about it. But here, about their advisory service, their big gimmick. Here's the gimmick with their service. Number one, he'll make five, ten trades a day, maybe, so you're getting a ton of text messages. A bigger problem is when he sends you the alert, he's already made the trade. So he's gotten in or out probably 5, 10, 15, 20 cents or more better than what you're getting in or out. For instance, if he bought 15,000 shares of CSI at 374, by the time you get the alert, the price might be up in a fast moving market. It might be 396 or 395. You buy it at 395, he could instantly sell his 15,000 shares at 395. He's made $3,000 as you're just buying in, he's getting out. So the alert service sucks because the market normally is moving fa fairly quickly when he buys in or sells. So you can rarely duplicate his prices. Also, he's probably got a quarter of a million dollar account, which very few people have. If you do, you probably wouldn't be subscribing to his service. But again, if you're subscribed, you make the mistake like I did of subscribing. There's a ton of alerts, and every time I've tried to click on or do a trade to mimic his, the price was quite a bit different than his trades, so I normally haven't taken them. Uh, actually, I've never taken them, but I thought I'd try this out for three months, and then I got conned into a, the paying the extra $4.99, which they're too tight to refund, even though he makes, he brags he makes $50,000 in a week on trading, some weeks $30,000, $40,000, they won't, and they can't afford to sub give the refund back, even though you notify them immediately you made a mistake, they can't afford to give a $4.99 refund back, you just can't afford to take all of his $50,000 profits he's making, uh, so I just thought I'd say stay clear, I think it's uh, a gimmick service. I think it's, uh, again, he's making money. When you get in there, you're going to pay more than he paid normally always. You're going to sell for less than he sold almost always. And again, he's cashing in on your late signals you're getting from him. So I think it's a big ripoff, a big gimmick. I think there's much better ways out there to spend your money. I think Jason Bond pick is not a good deal. Stay clear. Hope this helps you stay away from a bad investment. They've always got sales and gimmicks going on, so if you're going to make the mistake of subscribing, you might as well wait till it goes down to $99 for three months. But I, I wouldn't, even for that, it's not worth it. It's a joke. I wouldn't pay $99. I wouldn't pay $10 for it, but I'm stuck with it now, so I'll be getting tons of alerts for next year, and that's the way it is. I'm just trying to prove here they're a marketing company. They've got a ton of different stuff. It's... Like the rich person on his deathbed, they said, what would you like if you could have anything else in the world? He said, one dollar more. That's what this Jason Bond and Raging Bull reminds me of. They want to get one dollar more any way they can. So stay away from this marketing company and put your money elsewhere.